what's going on youtube it's rad here coming at you with another video um today i'm here at shelly lake in raleigh north carolina um it's a pretty nice greenway um it's got other greenways that extend out to it i like this one and it's right out on the outskirts of the lake um you get nice views from this bridge and um you see in the background it's a nice view from the hill you'll see later on in the video I decided to come out to this trail in particular um, reason being that this was the first place where I actually tried a one wheel uh, my buddy took me out here and said it'd be nice me inexperienced one wheeler um, I didn't think so this place is super rooty <laughs> it's bumpy and I can see why I was so terrified of this place when I first tried it Also, the guy that brought me out here to try the one wheel, he recently was out here not too long ago and he ended up injuring himself out here, um, hitting these rudy bumps. So yeah, that built up my confidence even more to come out here. But I do have a lot of confidence in roots and bumps now. Um, I am taking it a little slower than I usually do just because I'm just unfamiliar with the grounds. Um, it's kind of like my first time back here since March of this year watching this video has really shown me the progress i've made since my first time at this place um i have terrible memories here <laughs> nah it wasn't terrible it was just i was just an inexperienced one wheeler uh, my first day on a one wheel and i'm going around a booty trail with my buddy on a one wheel that i've never done before so first time around this trail we well I at least I hit maybe six miles an hour that was about the fastest I went around this trail <laughs> six not ten six six miles an hour I looked at the app it said I, you know what it wasn't even six it was 5.9 okay <laughs> we took forever to get around this trail like maybe two hours oh and there's a future one wheeler there um, I missed him the first time I'm waving but the beauty of this camera is I can see this now and I can give him a shout out now <laughs> sorry I missed you but yeah dude, we went around this trail at six miles an hour um, I was we were getting lapped getting lapped by people that were jogging like no kidding <laughs> people that were jogging lapped us <laughs> I can't even to begin to understand how that even happens but trust me you've never been <laughs> lapped by people that were jogging on a one wheel it's kind of embarrassing <laughs> Just reminiscing about that story and my one wheel adventures and my beginnings of it. it just made me want to just get out here and see what I would do out here now that I'm a little more comfortable with the board. Um, at this current moment, I have about 545 miles on my one wheel. Um, I've been riding this thing pretty much every day. I'm currently at like day 85 on my day street with over 500 miles so like i said i've read this board every day i miss one day because i've had it nailed early as stated before man this is the reason why i'm into one wheeling this is the place of what got me into one wheeling um i would never have thought that I would be in this community doing this type of thing. Um, I always thought they were dangerous and I didn't want to get hurt or hear about the stories of nose dives. If you're worried about one wheeling being too dangerous or you're going to get hurt, 
I mean, you may get hurt, but that would be on your own doing. As um, far as it being dangerous, it can be dangerous, yes, but what isn't dangerous in this world? <laughs> I mean, you're driving down the highway at 80 miles an hour. I mean, when I was thinking about it, when I was looking at all the videos of people, how, how they crashed and scraped and got boo-boos, I was just thinking, I rode a bike when I was young. I rode roller skates, I rode scooters. You know, I fell off all of those with no helmet, no knee pads, no elbow pads. Uh, I survived. Only difference was I didn't have Facebook or Reddit to go and show everybody my boo-boos and scratches. <laughs> so on my purchase thoughts, I just thought to myself, if I be careful and take it easy and not try to push myself too far than what I should be able to do, I should be fine. And like I said, and as of now, I still hasn't, haven't had a bad accident yet. Um, I'm afraid it might come, but it hasn't come yet because I do ride conservatively. Um, not pushing the limits to what I don't know what to do if I do want to try something new. Um, same thing I do with inline skating. And I, I try at slow speeds and then I work my way up. Um, I don't believe in you should be, you're not falling, you're not trying. I'm not doing all that. I'm getting older. Um, things hurt when you fall now. <laughs> pretty dope I mean just to see the progress how I'm not inching over every bump scared not going five miles an hour oh man it's great um, here's that nice view of the lake I was telling you about earlier in the video place um, there are some steep hills I need to conquer on this trail um, one coming up you won't see it I cut it out it's just way too steep to go down and I was just nah I'm always doing it but <laughs> once I conquer these hills mostly going up and I will feel like I've got my redemption of this place um, being that it at the same time, it terrified me, but it also got me into a sport that I seriously enjoy right now. Um, I can't stop doing this. Um, I will never forget about this place. This is where it all began and where it all started. Appreciate you guys, and y'all have a good night. Appreciate it.